Welcome again to CryptoJet, holders, shillers, and my fellow blockchain degenerates. Today, we're going to be talking about a very interesting project based on horse racing and earning real-world money built on the Polygon network. So we're going to go through the Twitter page, see how their community is actually looking like. You can always join them on Discord and follow them as well. You can check out their latest news, and we're going to talk about the collection of horses that you can actually purchase. So without further ado, let's get straight into the video. And if you actually enjoy it, Leave a like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on the best crypto news content. And of course, my beautiful voice. Now, let's get straight into it. So, own, race, and earn the basically the future of digital racehorse ownership is right here. Race your way to the top and build your legacy today. So, pressing this start button, you can actually start to play this game and uh, buy your horse or do whatever you want. They actually have a live stream for 111 viewers at this moment and they're streaming these horse races every single day so pretty much 24 hours uh, you can actually see horses racing uh, digitally and uh, you can actually breed horses you can do a lot of other if interesting things which you're going to see in a moment so these are the up and coming uh, races so you have Seville you have Salvador luck now everything and everything has a nice little entry fee so we're gonna see a little bit more about that later but you can actually join their Discord to see the latest horse drops that are coming out, or you can actually purchase your horses on the OpenSea Marketplace if there are no drops currently where other people are actually selling their drops for the, uh, you know, uh, on the Polygon network. So you can see that they're ranging from prices around 0 0.016 uh, Ethereum to, you know, even, even more expensive. They get gradually more and more expensive the more you scroll down. And uh, you can actually buy any of these beautiful digital horses. You can use a filter. You can do whatever you want. Now, moving on, you can create your stable as well. Have multiple horses, become a stable owner. Do pretty much whatever you want. And uh, right here, you see some of the most uh, lucrative and the best performing horses in the stud category. So you would actually have to connect your MetaMask and e or email to actually participate in uh, breeding of these horses. So... If you go into the breathing page, you can actually see that there is a certain time limit for receiving each of these horses. So this one is, for example, $540, and it's a legendary horse. This one is ex exclusive. This one is elite, so obviously it's a little bit cheaper, uh, but exclusive is less expensive than the elite one. Then you have the crossbreed, which is one of the cheapest ones that you can actually get. So it all makes sense with real life horse characteristics right if you're cross a horse obviously it's not pure blood and obviously it's going to be you know a lot cheaper so if you actually go into the racing page you can see all of the events that are actually coming out and uh, every single one of them has an entry fee so you actually pay a fee to enter and the prize pool and there's 12 out of 12 players that can actually join it so you buy a horse you join this you pay the entry fee and you get a chance to actually win it depending on your horse's characteristics so I assume in the game you can actually uh, train your horse and uh, make it perform better over time and uh, a lot of these other features because, uh, you know, obviously that's one of the aspects that has a uh, impact on who will win the race. But even if it's all completely uh, random, it is still quite good because horse racing is a gamble in real life as well and it should be gamble right here. So right now you can see three uh, or a lot more uh, free entry so you can actually like train your horse test it out and whatever so you'll see people joining over a little bit of time right here you can see the next to run so it's actually running live you can watch it on twitch and you can see the prize pool and the size of the actual prize pool you can actually own your own event if you want to create one uh, you can check your results pages from horses all around the world from your horse as well and uh, right here there is actually a inaugural tournament that is live and all racing events count towards qualification so it's live for another nine days and basically if you get into the tournament you can uh probably earn a lot uh a lot more money than the classical uh you know than the classic horse race so the prize pools are allocated proportionally to the actual uh right so the grand final there's 12 participants one race prize pool is 13 percent for these guys and uh the first place gets 60% of that, second place gets 25%, etc., etc. So that's going to be a lot of money in, in it because as you can see, there's a lot of people actually participating in it. 
This page right here is the Z sort of uh, uh, knowledge pool. So you can create your stable Z run wallet. You can read anything you actually want to learn about, for example, buying and selling a racehorse. So you can buy it on OpenSea. And also when they actually officially drop horses, you can choose your breeding goal. So you can make a championship race course. You can actually make a unique NFT racehorse so they can actually all be uh, so all of these horses each time an offspring is born a newly minted token is generated to represent your new offspring's dna profile bloodline genotype breed type and coat color so basically you can extend the holding of your unique nfts nft horses and also expand your stables legacy and obviously be able to sell it in the future so you can look about the dna race horse ability color pairs etc etc it is a very complex type of game and uh, obviously you can earn money on it as well or gamble or do whatever you want without actually physically having to go to a racetrack. So you have a lot about race, racing, breeding, their Twitch page, their Discord community. Uh, right here you can see their community news and everything. You can view their updates. So a few days ago they actually said the AMA with Rob Salcher and Jeff, Jeff Wellman or whatever. So just a lot of news here about the races and somebody's actually honking outside. It's pretty annoying, but in general, you can do a lot of things on this game and it's a very interesting concept. If you go to the breeding page, you can actually see a lot of these horses and how much it costs to actually breed. So, you know, it's a, to actually mint, sorry. So it's a lot of, uh, it's a lot of value in these uh, NFT horses. There is the marketplace, obviously, which is currently the latest drop is actually all sold out. So if you want to buy it, you have to go on to OpenSea. Now, if you actually go on to learn, you can learn pretty much everything that's going on in this game. This guy is still honking. I'm about to shoot someone. And uh, obviously getting started buying a racehorse, the help center, latest news, all of that ties in with this page right here where you can learn everything in more detail about this game. So I really appreciate that somebody made something like this because I do love horse racing myself. And it's a very, very interesting sort of project and especially to be tied into nfts so i imagine in the future we're going to see every single real life event somehow made across the board with nfts and uh, actually monetized in that sense that you can play games and do fun stuff on the internet and once you log out you don't actually lose everything but you continue making money by the increasing value of your projects and obviously purchasing a horse is a lot more expensive than purchasing an nft so here you can see about their updates and everything. I really recommend you follow them on Twitter, a community of 53k followers at this point. And that's pretty much it for today's video. Thank you all for watching, joining in into this amazing Z horse game, which is actually in its beta stage at this point. I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy it, leave a like, subscribe, and actually let me know if you want to see something special in the future. I will film it for you down in the comments below. You know, let me know. And... Uh, Thanks for holding and I'll see you all in the next video. Adios.